Hey guys, uh, I'm Stephanie's husband. Uh, as you all know, she's been on this journey to obtain this special bag uh, that uh, I don't know anything about. <laughs> but I got a uh, phone call from her essay saying that it is ready. Uh, so we're gonna surprise her together. I'll record it all, we're very excited. She still has no idea. Let's go, we're gonna walk down here. We're walking around Union Square, have a good time. Yeah, it's time to record it. Yeah. We're gonna be here soon. I just wanna look at something while we wait. Let's head up to level three. Let's go up to the we're gonna take the flow. We're gonna take the elevator up, okay? Hey, the button, the button. button. You can push the button when we get in there. Remember, the car's gonna be here soon. Well, this was, I made this last week. Two weeks ago when we were here. Mommy's gonna look around for a second and then daddy's gonna look around for what he needs while we wait for this guy to text me back. Um, Alright, so she figured it out pretty quick. <laughs> Super. I know. I think I think she was happier today than she was when I proposed. <laughs> exactly. That's right. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. Don't worry, mom likes this stuff. Maybe I should get rid of that bag, that uh, that uh, magazine. It's I mean, kind of, it's kind of a surreal. Like rush, so you're like, All right, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. I know. Where are we going next? Where are we going next? We got plenty of plenty of places to shop. Yeah. I'm very, I'm very happy for you, babe. I'm glad you got it. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Okay. This feels like surreal to me. And I know it's like, I don't know, is it silly? I just feel like I, I'm just beyond excited. Haven't stopped talking about it to, you know, friends and family who, you know, can understand and relate to me on this. Um, but yeah, I wish I could share some of the footage that we did take. We did take some videos and some photos inside the room uh, with my essay doing the unboxing and, you know, just like trying out the perks and, you know, all that fun stuff. Um, but just out of respect for her, she kindly requested that, you know, we not share anything um, during that moment. So, so I'm not going to do that. But um, I did do an unboxing already because I was so eager to take her out on the town. Uh, we went to brunch this morning and I, I, I wore her, I'm calling it her. <laughs> um, so yeah, let me insert a clip of that unboxing so we can get to a little story time and all that fun stuff.
<laughs> okay, so let me tell you kind of like how this day went down, like what happened leading up to our appointment um, when I got the bag. So I guess this my sales associate calls my husband um, and I, I must have been in the shower doing something with the kids and she was like, is Stephanie around? Um, can we, you know, do you have time to chat? I was like, yeah, sure, what's up? I, you know, she's busy or whatever. I wasn't privy to this conversation. I was not in the room. This is what he told me. And she was like, I have something for her. Can you guys make it down today? And obviously he's like, of course, you know. Um, so we're about 40 minutes from the city where we go for Hermes. And <laughs> um, so he was like, yeah, of course we can make it anytime, any day for, <laughs> for this. So um, yeah, but it, so, so that's kind of like their interaction initially. And it's funny because like right before, I think I must've been in the shower because right before the shower, we're like, what are we going to do today? It was Easter weekend. Um, we had some plans. We want to do something outdoors with the kids and with some family and it's a beautiful day. So we're like, we're, you know, let's plan this out. Let's figure out something. And so we had set on a specific plan and we're like, okay, so I think that's when I just like, was like, all right, let me go get ready. And then this is when the call occurred. And then he comes in and was like, actually, let's go to San Francisco. Let's go to Union Square. There's a car show in Union Square, which I was like, man, yeah, that's a weird place to have a car show, but okay. Um, so we went, so that, that was his story. So I was like, okay. Um, and it was a specific car that he's like really into and he's been eyeing for a while. So I thought, okay, let's go. And our kids are obsessed. Our boys are obsessed with cars. So we thought, okay. Uh, so I thought, okay, that makes sense. Let's go. They'll enjoy that. So then he puts jeans on and I was like, why are you getting putting jeans on? Because he's not like a like he's a sweats only guy. So when he put jeans on, I was like, "What? Well, this seems like a special event." He was like, "Yeah, it's pretty special." You know, he puts his Hermes Get sneakers on, and I was like, "Okay, so you're dressing up like we're going to prom or something, right?" Because um, I'm telling you, my husband is literally sweats only. You know, um, his idea of dressing up is like his luxe sweats. He calls them. Um, so, so when he put jeans on and his Air Mask sneakers, I was like, whoa, okay. So then I got ready and we went to San Francisco. We went to Union Square. We parked, you know, walked around for a bit because he was really nervous about getting there by three o'clock. And I'm like, well, it's just an event. Like, what does it matter if we're there like right when it starts? Like, we're not like a guest of honor or anything, you know? Um, and he was just like nervous wreck because of like the traffic and parking and the situations like... I could just tell he was like getting a little stressed out and he was like, Oh, it's just going to be such a fun afternoon. I just want to, you know, everything to work out well. And I'm like, okay. And at this point, I'll be honest, honestly, when he put the jeans and the Hermes sneakers on, I had suspicion. I was like, this is weird, especially because we had plans and now all of a sudden he wants to go to the city and it's just, that's not the usual order of events for us. Um, so yeah, so we get there. And he's still on this like, oh, car show thing. And I'm looking around, and I'm like, we're there. There's no car show going on right now. I'm here to tell you right now, we don't care. Let me tell you, <laughs> right, let me tell you. We don't care. So then um, I separate, I have to go to the restroom. So we go into Neiman Marcus and go to the bathroom real quick. And then he was like, oh, I just got off the phone with a guy. He says that the car show is canceled, but he's gonna pull the car up outside on Grant Street in front of Hermes for me to look at. So it's like this specific car that my husband's interested in. And I'm like, yeah. Okay. At that point I was like, okay, like whatever. I don't think this is what's really happening. And I, my suspicion had, you know, gotten stronger at that point. So we're walking by Hermes and he was like, let's just go in and, and see, like, I'm looking for a pocket square to go with this suit that he just got made. So he had made. And, um, I was like, no, nah, you go ahead and go in. I'll just watch the boys. Cause it is a to take this huge stroller that we have with the kids who do not want to be in there. It's just like a whole scene, you know? Um, so I was like, you just go ahead go look at the park square. I'll sit out here. He's like, and a part of me was like, I'm going to see how far he can push this. Like, how far is he going to go? Like, cause I, at this point I'm like, he, I, I know there's something going on. So he's like, Oh no, come on with me. Come on with me. So we're like, there's people trying to get in and out the door and we have this big stroller. So, and I think you saw some of the clips <laughs> um, of this. So I'm sorry if I'm being redundant, but I just wanted to share the story with you. But yeah, so then he tells the, the guard at the door, he has an appointment with my sales associate um, at, at three o'clock. And at that point I'm like, okay, he doesn't make appointments at Hermes. I make appointments at Hermes. Um, so the, yeah, 
so we go in and I see my sales associate. She's like, oh, hi, yeah, um, let me just finish up here. And then, you know, she told my husband, and then we'll, we'll get the, your suit measurements figured out. So if she had a different story, she was like, yeah. And apparently she told him to say all this, which obviously makes way more sense, is that they messed up some measurements of the suit and they had to get something fixed. Um, that would have made more sense to me <laughs> than all of this. But anyway, so their stories didn't line up. And okay, and then, then they, you know, we say hi and chat it up for a bit. They're still like going on this vibe about the suit measurements. And at this point, I'm just like confused because I feel like there is something for me that's going to happen. But like, I don't also want to get my hopes up and be let down. So anyways, long story short, actually, it's not short. This is very long. It says it's been almost six minutes now. So yeah, we made it into the little private room and that is when the magic Okay, so I've got the box here now that you've seen the unboxing. I did pack her back up because I just like, whenever I get done using it, I just want to like put her away again just so the kids don't get the markers out and go crazy on her. Oh my gosh, I can't even say that. That would just be devastating. But yep, so here she is in the flesh. This is a Kelly 28, the Cellier stitching, and it is gold hardware gold color and Epson leather and I'm obsessed I love it. I honestly love this handbag I also got this beautiful little twilly um my essay knows how much I love pink and I'm a very neutral girl but if I were to wear a pop of color she knows that pink is my vibe so I got this uh she put this on there for me and it comes with a shoulder strap which I will show you and I have some, you know, mod shots that I could insert as well if I haven't already inserted those. I'm not sure which order this video is going to go in. But, um, yeah. So, here's the shoulder strap. And it's not long enough for a crossbody. This one isn't. But I think you can, you know, kind of special order one or something to get one that's longer for the crossbody. But let me just attach this. And show you how long it is but yeah oh my gosh you guys I'm just like I still I can't believe like I woke up this morning I was like oh, it wasn't a dream it's real so here she is here's the strap um let's see let me hold it up so you can get an idea but yeah so this is about where it hits me As you can see can you see I don't know move this back a tad there that's a little bit better but yeah you can see and I'll try to get some better photos and everything too for you but yeah ah uh, it is literally perfect and it's just so funny because I I think I put in my wish list for this bag in August of 2023 and it is now the end of March um you know so it's been a few months and this was the first bag you know, the first kind of set of specifications that I gave to my sales associate, this exact handbag, you know, Kelly 28, I said, or 25, but I originally said 28, um, with the Cellier stitching, gold color, gold hardware, um, and the Epson leather, I thought just the most dur durable for me. And, um, so I went with that. And then as time went on, I thought, well, maybe they're just not getting this bag. Maybe this is a very rare, hard bag to get. So I started to broaden my scope a little, you know, I was saying, okay, I'll take the bag any tain or a taupe. Um, I'm okay with other hardware. You know, I do like palladium. I'll take rose gold, um, 25 or 28. Um, and, and so, you know, I just tried to broaden it a little bit just in hopes that I would get one that I would like. I also did add, I had Mauve Sylvester as a top choice as well, but I am so glad that it came in gold because I feel like Mauve Sylvester is such a beautiful color. I love it, but this is just classic. It's, it's just perfect in every way and it'll go with everything. So, you know, Mauve Sylvester is still something that I am looking into, you know, down the road, uh, maybe, you know, in, in a tw size 25 or something or even a different handbag altogether. Um, I just love that she knew me so well. She knew it was, you know, what I requested originally is what I truly wanted. And um, that's what she got for me. And 
she was very empathetic, you know, to the weight that I had. It was quite a long wait. Um, I know not as long as others. Absolutely. I'm completely aware of that. But, um, you know, she was saying, you know, she wanted to make sure that she got me exactly what I wanted. And I really respect that and appreciate it. Um, I'm also like a type of person that hates to like turn things down. I have, I've turned things down from her before, but I think she also knows that I don't enjoy doing that. She doesn't want to put me in that position. Um, and she just really wanted to make sure I, I loved it. And, um, I really appreciate that. So yeah, this is it. <sighs> This day has finally come and I never thought it would and I'm so happy. So yeah, and I'm so excited to share it with you guys. Honestly, like one of the first things that came to mind was like, yay, I can make a video for everyone and share it with you all um, and have you admire it as much as I do. So yeah, let me know your thoughts, um, you know, and if you're interested in Hermes and the whole like Hermes journey or whatever you want to call it, uh, I'd love to hear about your journey as well. So, uh, yeah, let's talk about, you know, what got me here, basically, um, what I've purchased, uh, to get this bag so far. So, um, back in, I want to say July or August, 2023. So how many months is that? August, September, October, August, September, October, November, December, January, February, March, eight ish months, um, is how long it took to get this bag. I purchased... Oasis sandals, bouncing sneakers, get sneaker for my husband, the ship or shippery sandals. Oh, my CDC bracelet here that I have. That was a big one. Constance to go wallet, another, another big one there. Some ready to wear items. I've got an etube sweater with the H motif on it. I have a black cardigan. Uh, sweater for my husband oh like one or two ties for my husband some perfume oh and then we also attended just last week or two weeks ago which probably I don't want to say contributed to this because I know this is a hot topic right now and so anyways um so yeah so we also attended a like bespoke custom made service event at Hermes where my husband um, custom made a suit, which I will share some clips with that, of that with you as well. Um, maybe I'll do a video, a separate video, just describing all of that and, and showing you how we picked that out and, and what we decided to go with on that. Um, I will share that with you. So we did that like last week or two weeks ago, I think. Um, so there's that suit that we had custom made. So yeah, I think that's everything that we've purchased at Hermes so far that led to this. Okay, so anyways, yeah. Um, and then what else? Oh, so uh, of course, like I had to do like a little post spend with my sales associate once I got this bag, which obviously I'm happy to do so. Um, and so I got a Kelly belt to match and I will insert a clip of that um of the unboxing of that because of course i already unboxed it and uh wore it with my bag this morning so let me show you that clip
so yeah um and then as i mentioned i got this twilly and i also got the other twilly that you just saw um the unboxing of it's the same style or same pattern um but in like a navy um let me get it back out is that it nope yeah this is it let me get it back out just to show you guys a little bit more up close um i love the navy and black and gold i thought that that would be very nice for the fall um and it looks very nice with the bag and i love that you know the edges here you know have the hermes paris on it and so beautiful and this one as well has the same um so i thought that was really cute nice little touch and yeah um i just like i don't know i'm just out beyond myself right now i just can't believe it uh let's see oh we also got and I know many of you are familiar with this. Um, this. I haven't opened it yet, actually. But these knotting cards, I need to go through these. And I guess it just shows you different ways to, you know, knot your twillies or your scarves, your, you know, silk, um, silk scarves and stuff from Hermes. So I'll have to open that up and run through those cards and kind of learn how to do all that fun stuff, you know? Because I know their silk selection is really nice and um, looking to get, you know, add more to my collection. So, so that'll be fun. Uh, but yeah, yeah. Thank you so much, you guys, for watching. And I hope you enjoyed this video. And of course, leave comments below if you have any questions. Happy to share my experience in further detail if interested. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. And if this is kind of, you know, your thing, you like you enjoy luxury fashion or I, I do non-luxury fashion. I do all kinds of fun stuff. So if that's your vibe, just like and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.